So I'm here with Ed Soares at the MGM. Yep. This is Polly G with MME Meltdown. How you doing, Ed? I'm doing great, man. How are you? Pretty good. You enjoying that ice cream you got there? Very good, man. Blueberries, or blackberries and uh, coconut and cookies and cream. I heard it was expensive. Very expensive. Yeah. Well, the greatest of all time is coming back. Yes. And January 31st. January 31st. And I can't wait to see that fight because I'm a huge Anderson Silva fan. Anderson Silva is the greatest of all time. Yeah. It's a fact. I believe that. And I'm here talking to you, asking, what's up with Anderson? What could you, what could you tell us, the fans? Man, he's doing great. He's got, uh, you know, good head. You know, he's, he's mind's focused. He's uh, back in Brazil. Um, looking forward to getting back in the octagon and um, doing what he does best. And uh, he's going to take on Nick Diaz. That's what it's scheduled. And, and his leg is, is all better. He's been healthy for, for months. Yeah, he's been healthy for months. He's been working out. And, you know, he had uh, great surgery, uh, real good physical therapy. And, you know, he, he worked really hard at getting uh, himself back into the shape. So you say he's pretty much almost 100% or would you say he's 100%? I'd say he's... 95, 98%. 98%. So we just want to see him back in the octagon. And uh, do you manage Lyoto Machida also? Yes, and, I do. And Katsangana? Yes. Well, I mean, and, you know, when Anderson Silva lost that night, I really thought like, the greatest in the world left us. And to see him come back is just going to be astonishing, you know? Yeah, I, I think not only you, but I think a lot of fans all around the world are going to be very excited to see him step back in the octagon and, like I said, do what he does best. Do you think this is a good matchup for him? I think it's a great fight. I think it's a great fight for the fans. I think, um, uh, you know, Nick Diaz is a guy who always brings it and, and people can say what they want, but he always makes it a fight. Right. Um, and I think it's, you know, it's got all the ingredients of being a great main event. He made it a fight with GSP, you know. He makes it a fight with anybody. And that's one of the Nobody's greatest. Good. And, you know, and I, and I believe that it's going to be much different than before. You know, you've got two martial artists who really respect each other. Um, Nick, I, I, I believe he, he just thinks he can beat Anderson Silva. And, and I think it's not going to be your typical trash talking sort of Nick Diaz you're going to get. You're going to get two uh, very respected uh, martial artists that are going to face each other and leave it all in the octagon. So yeah, Nick, Nick respects Anderson. Well, I, I believe so, yeah. I believe it too. Well, thanks for your time and I can't wait to see, you know, your best product come back into the UFC. Uh, I'm looking forward to it too. All right, thanks a lot, Ed. You're welcome. Thank you. All right, man.